Yo, what's up guys, AFC Dino here, and welcome to a new video. Uh, today we are going to be doing some random battles. I'm gonna queue up immediately. Uh, the previous one you guys seem to have enjoyed. And guess what guys, we hit 2,000 subscribers on YouTube. Uh, thank you. And yeah, hopefully these random battles will help real some new or pe new people or people are, who are interested in BPN. But yeah, let's analyze our team. So. click on them <laughs> yeah. oh left click okay but that's my team I have a Gaglian what does he do return choice band okay okay like double screen with hidden power fire psychic ooh flame warp that could be a winner for us so I lead off against the Houndoom. We do have a Vaporeon in the back though. Let's see. So 196 is his max speed with neutral nature. So let's check our stat. 85. I mean return should do a lot of damage. As he nasty puts up. This should do a lot though. I'm choice bandit. Ooh, I don't knock him out though. Swallow should outspeed him. Let's see. Oh. The EVs are really bad too. <laughs> okay, so if I look stat wise, I think the Poirin gets to it KO'd. But he will knock me out. Why? Why can I not go back? Ah. Hold up. Wait. What? Waiting for other players to confirm their teams. Okay, this feels really clunky though. What the fuck? Am I, am I max happiness, happiness though? Doesn't show happiness. Oh yeah, 100%. So, every, I guess I just did spaghetti damage. Like I expected, expected a choice band return, but max happiness to knock him out. But what is going on here, guys? Why can we not move? Um. Heck, flash PM, DR. Oh, double N. Is he stuck as well? Oh, I think it's slash. Stuck. Oh. Am I just... This ain't right. There goes my 100% win rate. Wonder if I'm able to queue. What? What the heck, guys? I couldn't click go back. Well, 
I'll pause the video till we get our next battle, but this is so strange. What the heck? I'm actually gonna relog. Be right back. Okay, guys, it says I'm restricted for a freaking an hour from matchmaking. What is this bug? <sighs> this is so dumb. I guess for the video, guys, I might as well. Boom. <laughs> Up on my other account. Wow. Okay, guys. I hope I'm on another account because I was restricted from queuing up from any tournament or ranked game uh, because of that game, apparently. So, I'm playing a random battle on my other account. Hopefully, not, not something stupid like that won't happen. Oh, we have a Tyranid, so uh, we're lefties. Okay. Let's see. Style Rock Pursuit Ice Beam Stun. So we do have a Stealth Rocker this time. Uh, does this guy have U turn maybe? Jump K Pursuit. Double Pursuiter. Angela. I always make full use out of this. I am going to be leading with Ampharos because that's what they picked for me. Battle Guard. Okay. But let's see what kind of matchup we'll get. Yen Yenma. So we have we have the type advantage here. Um the fire off a discharge, we're not gonna predict. I don't know what he has in the bag. Because Bug Buzz goes through substitute. There'll be some sort of choice pack set and clicks Bug Buzz on my sub. So, because he's definitely faster than me, because Ampharos is really slow. Uh I might be in trouble, like if he's choice packs Bug Buzz. Not sure how much that will do to me, but yeah, I just take free damage, and if that turns out to be a 2-8 KO, then I might be in trouble. <laughs> so, yeah. He goes in Illumise, okay. Leftovers. So, Illumise probably has Prankster ability. I'm gonna go, to, go directly into Tyranitar. We have. I know it's a bug type. Ooh, that sucks. We have leftovers anyway. I wanted to look for a Stealth Rock opportunity. But now, Blaziken comes in, and I don't have a switch for this. He's taking free damage, though. He's most likely going for the rock ty uh, fighting type attack. If it is a source then set, I might actually be in trouble. I sh the Dotro should outspeed him. So, what does my Angela have? Le okay. My EV light too? Okay. I'm gonna pivot into the Angela. Hey. From what I'm seeing now, Tangela is the least useful member. But it should be able to take on... Oh, okay, okay. Okay, I have to sec. I have to sec. But is he Flare Blitz? I don't know. I'm gonna Stun Spore. As he Source Dances, please hit. <laughs> okay. So I have a Dodrio in the back, which should outspeed him. Use Brave Bird. So, I'm just gonna damage him. I'm clicking Ancient Power here over Leech Sheet. Uh, just to damage him, that way I take less damage from clicking Brave Bird with Dodrio. But now my whole team should be faster than Blaziken. Like, Blaziken should have... Okay, 170 is his max. What he can have in randoms. I'm slower. With this, I'm slower. 85. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm not looking at the stats. 219. 189. Okay. I'm, I'm pivoting into Dodrio, though, because Brave Bird is such a strong attack. I could use Psychic too, but from what he has in the back, what, from what I can see, uh, Brave Bird does the most damage, so I just knock him out there. Uh, 
And that's why I needed the damage on him. I, l I took very little from recoil. Because I damaged him. Now Sneasel comes in. What's up with the those weaknesses of mine? <laughs> but he's definitely faster than me. Is he though? 219, 236, okay. He is. I do need to pivot into T-Tar. With leftovers, hopefully I can kind of wall this. If he's, if he's brick break, he's a brick break. There's nothing I can do about it. Then I have to weaken him with Ampharos. Yeah, he's brick break. I, I don't know how I would have gotten up rocks though. I need to sack something. Maybe I should have sacked Blossom, but um, what it is. So I'm just gonna discharge here. The ice punches. Take it decently well. I can I can do this. Discharge him, and he's gonna die to his own life orb. And I'm left over, so let's see. His uh, his ice pinch did 36. 36. Close though. That's close. I've got, there's no point in me attacking, so I'm using cutting guard. Oh my god. Oh, we luckily we thought. I was thinking about subbing, but if he put me below 25, or if, yeah, I would have died to Sandstorm. So that's why I'm not subbing. And ne next best thing is to Cotton Guard. I could have swapped as well, but I don't have a good Ice type resist. Okay, so Hound Doom hits 196. I do have Jump Kick in the back. Static. Hey, I got the cut. I have the Cotton Guard. I don't know. <laughs> I did Cotton Guard, so... There's no point in me predicting the Sucker Punch there. I'd rather just damage this. If he just clicked Flamethrower... <laughs> first, he would've <laughs> just killed me, but no. Dodoro was faster anyway. So what other attacks do I have on this guy? Pursuit. What item did I have? Choice Band. I'd rather lock myself into Choice Band. Uh, Redbird. There's only one Pokemon I haven't seen yet. I guess he could sucker me. But he can still get paralyzed though. Maybe I should have gone Giraffe. No, maybe I should have gone Blossom actually. Because I would outspeed him. If I went Blossom, I think that would have been better. So now I take Sucker Punch damage, unless he doesn't click it. That would be ideal. Oh, he actually switches. Okay, let's jam gone. Uh, I don't know why he kept Houndoom, because Houndoom is pretty much useless. My whole team is faster than Houndoom with him being paralyzed. He's Focus Slash, okay. Does he have Speed Boost? I don't see Speed Boost. Because he's Focus Slash, I should up outpace him. Because he hits 200, yeah. So, you can just click Raybird again. This is also the reason why I wanted Dodri on. Because it seemed like Dodro would just hit everything on his team really well. There's the Swellow though. Flame Orb. If he's Flame Orb. Okay. Then I have to hope the referee clips a hit. How am I beating? It depends. 2.43, like, I, I, I'm not faster than him. But he will outpace me. But if he's a facade set... Oh, okay, he just clicks Spray Bird anyway.
Going to Jerefric. I'm an, partly a normal type, right? And then I think Hyper Voice just gives me the best coverage. It's the same base power. Goes into Illumise. Crit. I'm not sure. 193 versus 89. He is physical though. Like if I'm not faster than him. Hold up. The EVs are, are all 85 so he should out... The EVs are all 85 on every stat. Like on every Pokemon. So he should outspeed me and if I take damage on this I lose to Swellow. I think we gotta go Blossom. I think we did have Hidden Power Fire though. But I might just lose to Swallow. Uh, just because I sacked the Renatar. Like, I, cannot, I cannot know what he has in the bag. I cannot know what he has in the back. Oh, I. Because Hidden Power Fire should not be. Should not have been enough. Oh my god. I'm gonna U turn into Houndoom. Oh, why didn't, why didn't he just sack Houndoom? So I'm still in a situation I want. Even though I don't think I will knock out the Swellow with my Girafric. Might as well quiver dance. I'm gonna die anyway. However, if I can get up, can get up enough call mines, I might actually be able to pull this off uh, by outplaying him with his sucker punches. Like he was sucker punching there. Flamethrower, Sucker Punch. There's another Sucker Punch. I, I I have enough damage now to knock out the Swellow. However... Uh, our moves are BP max, so I need to outplay this 8 times. But I also have to play around the thing from Swellow. Oh, I got it! <laughs> he did a click sucker. He did a click sucker. And Swellow should not be able to one hit KO me. Swellow should not be able to one hit KO me. So this is basically the same base power. Anything else? Kick Psychic. He U turns. I'm plus two. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> That's how we do it, boys. I think we can get on get in we can get in another one, guys. Man. <laughs> Would have been easy if I had to in the back. I should have expected the Sneasel to have break break. Like I was calling it out, but I didn't see. I didn't have a real switch, and I wanted to keep Blossom in case he did have a Water type in the back. Okay, we have a Duck Trail for Relegator. Oh, that's cool. Life Orb. Return Waterfall Aqua Jet Ice. So we we do have a priority move here. Does this guy have Stealth Rock? Okay, this guy has Stealth Rock, so we can just. I cannot lead. I cannot lead this though. 
I'm, I'm never clicking ready. I Because I'm leading... Okay, Pursuit Shadow. Trick Choice Band, which we can use. This guy has Trick Room. Okay. So we can use Trick... Let's just... This guy has a Chesto Berry. Oh, is, is it Harvest? Uh, it's Chlorophyll. Okay, this is not an ideal matchup. Um... I think all my attacks are resisted by that guy. Oh, only return, okay. But Executor does four times resist this attack. I have a Chesto Berry with Rest. He doubles into Scyther! Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Um, that's not good. Because <laughs> he... Buck is four times super effective versus me. I don't... How did... Why did he double that though? Okay. I do have Duck Trio in the back. This is a Sword Stance set with Trill Pack. Okay. I feel like Bane. I can go Bane at maybe. If I give that guy a choice band, it's not gonna be pretty either. I'm gonna go Duck Trail. I have a Focus Sash. I should outspeed his whole team. Oh, that did a lot. Uh, I know Duck Trail is really squishy. But stand to cruel. Ooh. Hopefully, he doesn't uh, rapid spin on this turn. That would be ideal. Nice. Okay. So I, I keep Bayonet. So he cannot rapid spin. Uh, he's, he has Waterfall, which is strange. Shadow Claw here. I just keep Bayonet so this guy cannot rapid spin. But now Scyther just takes 50% every time it comes in. Okay. I mean, that's a choice ban at Shadow Claw. And I crit him! Oh, let's go! Goes into Sapphire. Okay. So... Un Hold up. <laughs> Sapphire is only a poison type, right? It's not a dark type, right? <laughs> this is literally the first time I encounter Sapphire in PvP. Yeah, it's only a poison type. It's only the... It is is literally the first time I encounter a Viper in PvP. <laughs> okay. So I actually don't want to take damage on this. But my poison type... Well, I have to have a Psychic type in Slow King. Does Slow King have a recovery move? No, it's fully offensive. It's a, I think Slow King offensively does really well versus him as well. Um, How do I want to play this then? I honestly don't really need Stealth Rocks. I am Shadow Clawing again as he sucker punches. Is that gonna kill me? It's not gonna kill me. He's life warped. And that's a lot of damage off on him. The Survivor is 156, so he's definitely faster than me. I do want to keep this though. I'm going into Ferelegator here. I can Aqua Jet him uh, on a sucker punch. Uh, later on, I don't think he click. Uh, he does click sucker, so I can just aqua jet him here. Like he has to come in on style rock. Uh, if he switches out, my Ferelegator has sword stance, life orb. Okay, so I aqua jet him so I don't get hit by the um, sucker punch. And if he goes into Tentacruel, I'll just go directly into Bayonet. Uh, preventing him from rapid spinning. That's the case. Like, I don't know what other mods he has in the back. He does end up trying to rapid spin there. I'm gonna trick here. 
even if I get this black sludge. Maybe he just knocks me out though. Oh, flinched! No! No! That would have been massive though if I got got that off. I can go sloking now. Like I said, Polyrath is what he has in the bag. And we can just go for Psychic. I don't need to click Trick Room because my Dodra is pretty fast too. He doesn't end up going for Rapid Spin. So he does get rid of the rocks. I guess he really wanted it. But that gives me a Life Orb Psychic and that just knocks him out. So what does he have in the bag? 4 versus 3. Polyrath. Why? Are you going into this? Something must be up, but... He's belly rimming in my face. He's belly rimming in my face! I'm live or psychic. <laughs> I, get I guess he was getting desperate. Slow King. The Beast. Hold up, hold up! I, I think he's just going to get swept. <laughs> Wait, can, can, can he actually learn that move? Can he actually learn that move? <laughs> but still though, this should not come out, I'm live for... Look at our boy Sloking going! Oh, that's the spin now. Oh, let me just psychic. I'll let him knock you... I'll let him knock him, knock him out. Knock him out. <laughs> Man. So I do have Relegator in the back. I do have Dodrio. I think Dodrio has Jump Kick as well. Yeah. I don't think I need to click it though. He double edges. So how fast has this been? 107 max. He's a 67, so I should be outspeeding him. I, I want to do something with this guy. The relegator. Oh, there's no sword stance. It's gonna waterfall then. Lynch him. Easy. <laughs> Easy. Okay. Let's take waterfall again. He forfeits and we win this game, boys. So, yeah. <laughs> so, some clutch victories. Really unfortunate uh, about the first. The, the first battle was really unfortunate. Uh, me not being able to click anything. And then, apparently, timing out and getting disqualified from joining any ranked matches or tournaments for an hour, which. Nothing I can do about it, guys. But yeah, hopefully you guys still enjoyed it regardless, regardless of what happened. And if you did, make sure to hit that like button, guys. Subscribe to the channel. We passed, we are past uh, 2,000 subscribers. I what when we started playing Pokemon Mo, I think we got 1k subscribers in a year, which is awesome. Because uh, it took me like two years on um, Poke One uh, to get to, to the 1,000. So yeah, the community on Pokemon has been amazing. Um, rarely am I encountering any toxic people. Maybe they are there, but I never really reach out. So I guess that's the plus. Uh, yeah, it's just the dynamics seems really, really nice. And yeah, leave a comment down below if you have any questions. Join our Discord server if you'd like to get some PvP help from our community. We have a Raid My Team channel. And basically you can post your team in there and get feedback from the community uh, we have people respond responding really quickly as well so de definitely nice to check it out and uh, check my patreon as well as if you are interested in the teams i'm using in my videos unfortunately i don't have any teams for random battles <laughs> as they are random but with that all being said guys i hope you have a wonderful day and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out